Hello children. Today we are going to see 7th class, 14th lesson, science, question answers. Improve your learning. First one, fill in the blanks and give reasons. Cleaning of water is a process of removing dash. Impurities. This is to remove the pastage to get purified water. Waste water released by houses is called dash. Sewage. This is a liquid waste which causes harmful bacteria and other microbes. C. Dried dash is used as manure. Sludge. The soft, wet earth or substances which are used as manure. Next, D1. Drains get blocked by dash and dash. Answer, oil and fat. The impurities stagnated in water which releases some oil and fats like fossil fuels. Next one, what is sewage? Explain why it is harmful to discharge untreated sewage into rivers or seas. Answer. First point, all the waste water released by homes, industries, hospitals, offices and other users are collectively called sewage. Sewage is a liquid waste. Most of it is water which has dissolved and suspended impurities disease causing bacteria and other microbes these impurities are called contaminants next point if this is discharged into canals it causes a lot of harm to animals human beings aquatic animals and plants if this water used Next one, why should oils and fats not be released in the drain? Explain. Oils and fats should not be released in the drain. If they are released, they do not dissolve in water and at the same time attach themselves to the walls of the drain. These catch other material and finally obstruct the flow of drain water this makes the drain water stagnate causing new sanitation problems okay this is the third one now we'll see fourth one describe the steps involved in getting clarified water from wastewater Answers. Stage 1. What waste water is passed through bar screens. Large objects like rags, sticks, cans, plastic packets, etc. are removed by this. Okay. So like this bars will be kept. Okay. So these are, these all the material will be removed in this stage. Second stage, water then goes to a grit and sand removal tank. The speed of the incoming waste water is decreased to allow sand, grit and pebbles to settle down. Stage 3, the water is then allowed to settle in a large tank which is sloped towards the middle. Solids like feces settle at the bottom and are removed with a scraper. This is the sludge. A skimmer removes the materials like oil and grease. Water so cleared is called clarified water. Okay, this is the fourth answer. Now we'll see fifth one. What is sludge? Explain how it is treated. Sludge. 
waste water is passed through bar screens already we have seen in previous answer after removal of large objects water goes to a grit and sand removal tank here water is allowed to settle on a large tank which is sloped towards the middle solids like feces settle at the bottom and are removed with a scraper this is the sludge next point the sludge is transferred to a separate tank where it is decomposed by an aerobic bacteria the biogas produced in the process can be used to produce electricity air is pumped into the clarified water to help aerobic bacteria to grow bacteria consume human waste food waste soaps and other unwanted matter still remaining in clarified water after several hours the suspended microbes settle at the bottom of the tank as activated sludge the water is then removed from the top the activated sludge is about 97% water the water is removed by sand drying beds or machines dried sludge is used as manure returning organic matter and nutrients to the soil sixth one untreated human excreta is a health hazard explain answer if the human excreta is left untreated it reaches the cana canals through rain water the canal water is contaminated with this people who use this canal water are prone to many diseases thus it is a health hazard next one name two chemicals used to disinfect the water answer chlorine and ozone are the two chemicals used to disinfect the water eighth one explain the function of bar screens in a waste water treatment plan answer large objects like rags sticks leaves cans plastic packets etc in waste water are removed by the bar screens in a waste water treatment plant ninth one explain the relationship between sanitation and disease answer sanitation plays a major role in keeping good health for the public if the sanitation is poor both water and air becomes polluted public depend upon these two items for the healthy living if they are contaminated public health becomes a big threat neglected sanitation leads to diseases in the people living nearby 10th one outline your role as an active citizen in relation to sanitation answer i shall educate the members of my house to keep the house and surroundings clean and neat i request the neighbors not to throw away their household wastes on roads or at any place of their choice i shall suggest them to separate organic and inorganic wastes and hand over to the people who collected these waste materials I propagate the importance of sanitation by mouth and also with my friends. I cooperate with all organizations who work in this direction. What would you do to motivate people in your street to utilize toilets? I explain the people about the importance of using toilets. I shall emphasize how one is prone to get hookworm if goes for defecation in the open. 
Further, such things lead to the contamination of air and water, which causes a threat to the health of the people living nearby. If toilets are used, the waste materials go deep into the earth and become soil in course of time without creating any problem. Defecation in the open attracts mosquitoes, house flies and other insects which in turn transmit diseases. Twelfth one. What would happen if there were no microbes that break down wasters in sewage? Answer. Microbes are doing a lot of service in breaking down the com complex organic compounds in waste materials to simple structured substances. These substances ultimately becoming a manure. If there were no microbes, our life will be in danger. All the waste organic ma material remain as it was and pollute air and water posing a big problem to our survival. Next 13th one. What point would you, see, would you like to address in the letter for your panchayat officer about drainage system in your village or town? Answer. The drainage system in our town is very poor the drains were not cleaned regularly by the sanitary people. The drain walls or pipes in some places were broken and the drain water is not freely flowing due to obstacles. When it rains, all the drain water along with the rain water is occupying the roads, making it very unhygienic. We Therefore, request you to attend to this drainage repair work. Next, 14th one. Okay. Go to nearby railway station or bus station, hospital or industry. What type of sewage is released? List out where and how. This actually you have to do yourself but for example, I am giving here for reference. Okay. But you try to do your, this answer by yourself. Place, railway station, type of sewage, eatable items, plastic bottles, teacups, etc. From where to how, where and how. People throw half of eatable items, empty pet bottles, cups, etc. Next, bus station, the same thing, bus station also. Hospitals, used syringes, cotton, bandages, etc. Due to accidents and certain operations. Industry, ash, chemical, wastewater, etc. Some chemical substances are obtained in the process of preparation. Okay. And you try to do yourself, okay, by finding out the sewages, okay, in different places. Next, 15th one. Fresh water is scarce. What is your contribution to make your family members aware of the need to save water? Answer. I shall see that my family members follow the following methods of using water. First, pick up water that is required for drinking. Do not throw away the water left out in the glass. Water used for cleaning rice and vegetables will be sent to the garden in the backyard. For bath, required water is to be used. I suggest the members to use mild soaps as the water after bath can be sent to plants in the garden of the house. No spill out of water from the tap must be seen by every family member. Think before you use every drop of water in is, is the suggestion I put before the family members. Okay. So this is the 15th answer. Next 16th one. 
नेक्स्ट सिक्सटीन वन प्रिपेयर एटलीस्ट फाइव स्लोगन्स ऑन डोंट वेस्ट वाटर फाइव स्लोगन्स ऑन डोंट वेस्ट वाटर यू कैन राइट दीज और यू कैन राइट ऑन योर ओन ऑल्सो ओके और फ्रॉम अदर सोर्सेस फर्स्ट वन वाटर इज आ करेंसी यूज इट विद केयर सेकेंड वाटर इज आ लाइफ सेव इट थर्ड वाटर इज प्रीशियस यूज इट बट do not throw it fourth say water never become a partner for its shortage fifth save every drop of water that you can okay you can write on your own also some more slogans you can add okay next 17th one make a write up for your project on preservation of rain water answer if villagers take up the activity of sludge removal in tanks more water can be stored in them government should take up the renovation of lakes tanks from time to time ground water increases if check dams are built over rivers streams and river riverettes this water can be used for all purpose the the rain water which flows from rooftops and can be diverted into a pit or a big tank in the surroundings of the house and this water can be used for few days okay next 18th one is there a check dam or any other water conservation un- unit in your village write a note on it we have a water tank in the middle of the village near the Z- uh, zilla parishad high school all people of our village get water from that tank in the morning and evening okay this is for example only write about your village okay next 19 have you any doubts about diseases caused by untreated water list them out answer what are the diseases caused by using untreated water what are the steps to be taken to treat the untreated water what are the different methods used to treat the untreated water there are many water borne diseases some of them are listed below cholera typhoid malaria diarrhea next 20 20th okay if you see water running off from a public tap what would you feel about it answer if you see water running off from a public tap i would feel responsible and become alert as water is valuable natural resource immediately i turn off the tap and stop the run of water if the control system of the tap is not there I shall take measures to close the way out of water and report the same to the authorities. Okay. Next last one. Prepare a logo for International Water Day. Okay, this you have to done you have to do by your yourself. Okay, and just for sample here it's given World Water Day and water drop is given and below water is given. Okay. This is for example but you try to do it yourself. Okay. by this we have completed 14th lesson question answers in next video we'll see the next lesson question answers till then bye kids have a nice day